two basic types of bricks. There's extruded bricks, bricks with holes in them, and then there is dry pressed bricks, which are solid and have an indentation, which is called a frog. Most people seem to think that the solid brick is the strongest of the two bricks, and in most cases that's incorrect. Uh, the strongest brick is actually an extruded brick. Um, it uh, has a compressive strength, uh, or an F-UC, uh, of approximately anywhere between 15 and 25 MPa, subject to the, to the way that it's been manufactured. Dry press bricks, generally speaking, are less than that. Um, from a durability perspective, um, you've got a couple of different factors to, uh, to think about. So if you're building close to the ocean, uh, in actual fact the BCA says that if you're building within one kilometre of the ocean front, you should be using an exposure rated brick. Uh, that just means that it, that brick will, will um, withstand the severe marine environment and won't deteriorate over time. Whereas if you use a, a general purpose brick, um, you, you run the risk of that brick actually deteriorating over time um, due to the environment that it's um, being used in. When we talk technical properties of bricks, um, you not only talk durability and you not only talk strength, but you also talk uh, a very fancy term called the coefficient of expansion. Um, it's essentially, it's brick growth. Um, so clay bricks, when they're, when they're manufactured, they will grow over a period of time and the coefficient of expansion is the measurement of that growth.